what companies are actually just pyramid schemes. Variant Trucking, Sensi, Tupperware, Avon, and most other companies where you have to buy into it and then you get to hire downstream to work for you. There are tons of other BSMLM pyramids as well that sell absolutely nothing but still get you to join up in the same way. If it follows the MLM layout it's a pyramid scheme by definition. It's honestly shocking how so many of those exist despite them being extremely obvious. I guess someone is lining the pockets of some congressman to keep the rules just bendy enough to allow it. Mary Kay. If you are unpopular and flat busted do not give those scam artists your money. You're unpopular and flat busted. It's time to go to Taco Bell training school. Time to apply to Walmart. Don't fall for a Mary Kay lady trying to sell you $100 of merchandise to get started. Unless you're a former pageant queen or former cheerleader. It's a weird pyramid scheme of tricking people into thinking they can sell makeup. The products are fine. They just try to recruit people who aren't prepared. Plutus. The whole value of their cryptocurrency is based on more users stacking said currency. The rewards are paid in their currency so the more attractive they are by having more rewards, the more users they need to attract to buy more coins. In the end, the whole system lives by hoping they launch in the US and gain massive amounts of new users or becoming more banklike in this more attractive somehow and gaining new users, or making existing users not cash in their rewards. These, of multi-level marketing companies. Of course, they'll say they of course aren't pyramid or illegal but they are pyramid schemes. Keller Williams The real estate brokerage is a registered MLM. Their profit sharing makes them an MLM and by extension, a pyramid scheme. Source they tried to recruit me years ago and I did the research on their business registration and profit model. If the business is structured in such a way that you make most of your money from sales commissions, it's a hard job, but it might just be legit. If the business is structured in such a way that you make money by recruiting people, then it's a scam. Sadly, most breast cancer awareness companies, they don't give any money to actually solve the problem and only say they are promoting cancer awareness while they profit from the donations to just keep it going indefinitely. It's really sad. Solar companies. So many people installing solar panels to reduce their electric bills, then it takes 10 to 20 years to just to pay off the installation. A lot of midlife to seniors will not pay this bill off before they die. Live good. My neighbor continually tries to get me sucked into this. When I tell him it's an MLM he responds with well, you have to stick with it for starters this industry was built for the long term and not a quick hit. Cutco, pretty much anyone selling knives for some reason. Business model for selling steak knives etc seems to be let's sell them to our salespeople and let them worry about how to offload them. Apple. You don't just buy the main product, whether it be a computer a phone, or a tablet. You have to, by design, buy all the accessories, because it won't function without them. Amway. I was invited to one of their events where they showcase diamond status members. My god. Seems like something I am going to see on the Netflix documentary soon. Investment banks. They get in all of these college grads super early and burn them out before they have any chance at moving up the ladder. Social security. They pay current retirees from current investors hoping they will have enough future investors to pay current investors every single MLM company come on people learn the difference between an MLM and a pyramid scheme pyramids are illegal MLMs are just sleaze buckets the military one guy on the top then it just gets wider each step down at the bottom they're making almost nothing that you can make thousands of passive income from minimal hours a week from home no you can and no you won't. Companies that pay employees 100 commission but don't sell a tangible product. E-insurance, crypto, etc. If you're not getting a paycheck but you're working your ass off, it's probably a scam of some kind. Not me just saving and screenshotting this post to know which companies to keep at arm's length lol. All of them. People at the top make all the money and the people at the bottom make shit. Moan it. Those ladies are a damn death cult built around a shampoo MLM. Shit's crazy. A TT a worrying number of people who don't know what pyramid schemes actually are. Bitcoin. Neat. Bitconnect. Bitcoin. Neat. Cutco. They sell it at Costco. They sound similar. Coincidence? I think so. Send me $40, and I'll show you a fail-proof plan to make hundreds instantly. EXP Realty. Realtors that also recruit and pass on earnings to higher-ups. It's all in the family. Plexus. 
It's a pyramid scheme for Christians or a modern one. Apparently no one here knows what a pyramid scheme is. Sagrity S. Max, or whatever they're calling themselves now. Ramses III's free construction educational internship.